Hey everybody and welcome to this 15 minute stretch for stiff shoulders. Starting off in an easy pose, let's just roll our shoulders back, nice and slowly, just warming them up, just adding some movement, lubricating those shoulder joints. Last one, and now we're just going forward, same thing. Going through the entire shoulder blade, making sure to sit nice and tall here, not allowing those shoulders to collapse down. Keep that posture nice and straight. And last one after this, and we're gonna come for a little bit of a funky movement where we drop our shoulders down and then we bring our shoulders back, almost like we wanna touch our shoulder blades down as well as the head. And then lengthening here, opening that chest, lengthening in your neck. And down with your head and shoulders. And now up, nice long neck down and then opening up and down and open up the chest and bring those shoulders back and then release your head to the side your shoulders can come to a nice relaxed position but they should still be down and you should keep a nice posture here And now just bringing your head down diagonally. And then now all the way down, hold it here. And just nice deep breaths, allowing your breath to guide you into these positions. Coming up. And then the other side, still keeping that nice posture. Don't let it go. Nice inhales and exhales here. Now down diagonally. And then down to center again. Now come back up with your head. Let's just inhale, reach our arms all the way up to the sky, grabbing our right hand around our left wrist, really lengthening here, and then exhale, coming to that right side, stretching your side body, just holding here for a quick moment, and feel that you're pulling on that wrist. Now release your bottom arm down, and continue to stretch to the side. Holding your head up here, trying not to let it dangle down to the shoulders. And now release. Let's repeat that on the other side. You can switch out your legs. And then let's just inhale, our arms right back up, grabbing the other wrist, lengthening, and then exhale, coming to the other side. Hold. And then release that bottom arm and hand down to the mat. And then just continue to stretch that side body. Feel that nice line from your hip all the way to your fingertips. And now just release out of this position. Let's just bring our knees together and then just come around Inhale, exhale into your child's pose. Just hold here. You're welcome to rock side to side even, or even just rocking your head side to side, massaging that forehead on the mat. You can even open up your hips a little bit more here.
and now slowly coming to your all fours position. We're gonna take our classic cat and cow. So inhale, first arch your back. And then exhale, rounding out the spine, bringing your chin to your chest. And then inhale again, arching, looking up. Exhale, rounding out that spine. Just warming it up. Adding some movement into our body. And now come back to neutral. And we're just gonna inhale our left arm up. Exhale, bring it under our other arm. Our top arm is gonna go above our head. And we're just gonna hold this nice gentle twist. Breathing deeply in and out. And if at any time you feel uncomfortable, or it's too intense, you can always just release to a child's pose. This is your practice. I'm just here to guide you. Let's hold here for a few more breaths. And now begin to release. And we're gonna take that on to the other side. So inhale your right arm up. Exhale, bringing it under, releasing your head onto the mat and your left arm goes above your head. Feel this twist and if you can, try to look up to the ceiling, try to twist that upper body. few more breaths here. See if you can twist just a little bit more. Almost done. And now just begin to release, coming back to your all fours position. Inhale, bring your hands in front of you. Exhale, coming to your puppy pose. Dropping that chest to the floor, hips are in line with your knees. You can bring your forehead to the mat to make it easier or look straight ahead with your chin on the mat to make it a little bit harder. You're gonna feel this stretch in your shoulders. Really great if you've been sitting all day at work. It's also really good to do in the morning just to warm up and mobilize those shoulders. And allow your breath to guide you here. Inhaling, sending oxygen into those shoulders. Exhaling, trying to go a little bit more into this position. Allow your focus to be just on the breath. Now just slowly release onto your tummy, coming onto your elbows and into your sphinx pose, lifting and looking up for a moment, using your back muscles here, breathing. And now release onto your belly. Push yourself all the way up and into your child's pose again. A nice counter stretch after that sphinx pose. And not staying here too long. Inhale, come to your all fours. Exhale, tuck your toes under and come to your down dog. We're just gonna walk it out here first. Gently warming up those calf muscles and the hamstrings. can add some hip movement here if you'd like. 
whatever feels good for you. Now bring your heels down, nice long neck, fingers are spread wide. Inhaling deeply, exhaling out. And now just start to walk yourself to your hands, taking as many steps as you need, bending your knees, coming to seated. Our knees are gonna be hip width apart, bending. And we're just gonna take our seated cat and cow, so grab under your knees, inhale, exhale, rounding out your spine, taking a nice pull. Inhale, arch and look up. Exhale, rounding it out, feeling that nice stretch in between your spine and your shoulder blades. Inhale up. Exhale. And inhale up. Exhale, round it out. And inhale again, coming up. Exhale, round it out, pulling slightly, and then releasing your hands and lowering yourself slowly down onto the mat. We're going to take our fish pose. Don't mind me fixing my hair. We're going to flex our feet, stretching our legs. Hands are going to be under our bum, and we're just going to take a nice arch in our spine. The balance is going to be on our head, but we're not going to be bringing any weight onto the head. The weight is all in the elbows, so you literally could even lift your head technically in this position. So make sure to bring that weight to the elbows. Keep this nice arch. Breathing here. Feel your chest and your heart opening. And as we release, we're just gonna bring that chin to our chest and then slowly releasing our upper body and our back down. So now begin to release this pose, chin to your chest, and then releasing all the way down. Release your hands. And then just grabbing your knees, rolling yourself all the way up. And you are finished for today. Thank you all so much for joining me and I hope this helps you with your stiff shoulders and I'll see you all next time.